The surplus of military vehicles in the years following World War II was a boon for the fire service. Military vehicles were especially helpful to departments that served rural locations. They were adapted for rural firefighting with the addition of Indian backpack tanks and other equipment. Indian tanks were effective in extinguishing brush fires because with the sweeping motion of the nozzle, you could cover a lot of ground. The 1942 General slash Chevy from Lamontville Fire Department of Kingston, New York is a great example of adapting military vehicles for daily use. Although the truck was built as a World War II Army truck, it actually never served during the war. In 1944, the truck was sold as Army surplus to Lamontville, who used it as a brush rig for nearly 40 years. Note the blackout lights that would have been used by Army convoys while traveling at night. The tiny slits of red light prevented the trucks from being seen from the air, which was a huge concern in the days and months following the attacks on Pearl Harbor. The 1955 Buchanan Cascade Air Truck was retrofit to provide air for SCBA tanks for firefighters out on duty. This truck began its life as a pumper with a 1941 Jeep engine. After 20 years in service as a pumper, it was adapted for a Cascade air system. A Cascade system allows smaller units to be filled without the use of a separate air compressor. The Buchanan truck, nicknamed Utility 12, was often called upon for use at fire scenes because of its ability to provide an unlimited supply of air when battling a blaze. Such was the case on September 11, 2001, when it reported for duty against the War on Terrorism. The Stockport Brush Buggy was built in 1952 and was used in the military for civil defense. After being decommissioned, it was donated to the Stockport Volunteer Fire Department of Stockport, New York, who had the truck in service from 1978 until 2012, fighting brush fires or used in any other circumstance that required an off-road, four-wheel drive vehicle. This truck is noted for having been the only vehicle able to climb a steep rise to fight a fire in Copake, New York back in the day, 